Hi, everybody. Hi. Hey, hey, hey. Um, so Facebook decides today, no offense to Facebook, Facebook decides to like change their whole platform. So when Matt and I were sitting down getting set up, everything looks different. And so it didn't, everything is in a different place. Everything's over here and over there. And so it's a little bit crazy. So anyway, I actually ended up being one minute late. So um, how is everybody today? It's time. I put on a pretty shirt. Sorry, I just had to. Hopefully no paint will get on here. I actually am going to paint. Um, as you can see, I've worked a little bit. Well, you probably can't tell the difference, but I've been working on this. I've also added lots more paints to both sides. I've got more drips. Um, so tonight I actually have pennies from heaven. And I'm going to highlight all of these glorious details here, the hardware, the hinges, and I'm going to kind of frame out some of the molding here. And uh, I just want to say hello. And if this is your first time here, my name is Dion Woods and I'm the owner and artist at the Turquoise Cyrus. Um, I see that a lot of you are saying we're ready for the news and I am super ready to tell you. I'm a little nervous. I've got a little bit of tightness in my stomach, a little bit of warmth under my arms. I'm a little breathy which means that I'm nervous. Um, Matthew, how are you, babe? Good. Doing real well. Just doing good. Doing good. He says doing good. He's He's doing good. He doesn't have to do the hard stuff, you guys. So I'm going to get my pennies, of he pennies from heaven, but I also have some to give away. If you recall, I asked you guys the other day to go ahead and pass this video around to the interwebs, um, and 108 of you did. Thank you. And on um, YouTube, so many of you did as well. And I just want to thank you for that. Uh, thank you, Mom. But I'm nervous, Mom. Um, so I'm going to send this. Thank you so much for doing the shares. You guys are incredible. 108 just on Facebook and even more on YouTube. Um, Vicki Marlatt, M-A-R-L-A-T-T. Message me with your address. I would love to send you this pennies from heaven. It's $33 value. And it's the exact product that I'm actually going to be putting right here on this piece of furniture. Um, so I know that you're all tuning in to see me paint this, right? Yes. Uh, yeah. That's, that's why. The, that's the only reason. That's I'm the here. only reason. Um, so you switched over from IG. Thanks, Carrie. Hey, spill it, sis, says Amber. Um, you guys. So I have an announcement today and I've been teasing you guys for the last week or so with some news, uh, maybe two weeks. And the reason for that is I had a few things that I wanted to get set up and in place before I uh, busted out the information. So I do really want to work on this and do the hardware and I am pro do promise I'm going to tell you the news. Um, it's the thing that's making me breathy right now and a little bit. <laughs> why don't you, why don't you paint, why, why don't you get a little bit of painting? It'll get everybody a little bit of time to get on. Okay. Cause it looks like we've got a lot of people on, but okay. give, give them a couple of minutes. Just make sure everybody's on. All right. And then I will talk about myself and I'll just talk about how, how cool I am. Yeah. And, um, wow, that's, that's going to be helpful. So yeah, I mean, I could go all night. I have really been entertained by all of your ideas on what you feel like I'm going to tell you. There have been some good ones. Matthew, what's been some of your favorites where people are guessing what my news is? I think the funniest one that, that I liked was, was Rob and Derek. They think, uh, the surprise is I'm going to paint the room. That you're going to paint the bedroom. I thought that was pretty clever. They remembered and they just thought, you know what? That 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 sounds like something we would do. That Got a big announcement. Matt is painting the room, right? It's yeah, like a but big deal. I'm not quite that ornery. I know you're not, but I am. And that's, <laughs> that's why I thought it was really funny. So. so I thought also for me, some of the most, the ones that really stood out to me were people suggest, now you guys can throw out your suggestions right now. Thank you, Betty, for sharing. I really do appreciate this. Um, some of the questions or, you know, suggestions were that I'm pregnant. And I told you guys from the very beginning, don't even say that because I'm not. <laughs> there was some of that. There was um, a teenage. Yeah, there were some that were like, wait a minute. Maybe there were this some, is not going to be as cool as we thought yeah, it was. Yeah, there was some that was like TV show. You're going on. And Matt, you and Matt have HGTV. And I thought, oh, they're going to be a little bit disappointed. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Beth says you're going to be on Survivor. How fun! 
I would be terrible at that. I have a mosquito bite right now on my ankle just now that I got while I was outside having a little quiet time trying to calm my nerves. And I got a mosquito bite. Me and Survivor, Beth. Mm -mm. Um, so Mal John said that too. Um, so throw out your ideas. I'm trying to get myself just a little bit more calm um, because of course I have a story to tell with all of this. Like I have a story. So I need, I need to make sure I tell the story. <laughs> Elizabeth, Elizabeth Ann's uh, Artesian Market, you're going on Survivor. Now that would be funny. You did, you that's what I just said about the mosquito. I know. That's I know, what I was but, just saying. Oh, yeah. that would be yeah, I would be a terrible on Survivor. Like, terrible, terrible. This is Pennies from Heaven. I'm going to give this away to Vicki Marla. If you're just now popping on, sister, send me your address. So I'm going to dab this on the hardware. Paula, Paula Harry Shin. Uh, she says, tease, spill it. Tease, spill it. All right. Get that, just get that little gold on there and do a little. I know, do a little Pennies from Heaven. Little pennies. I'm just actually lightly, I'm using the assistant from my brush line and I'm just brushing over the mold in a really sheer layer to highlight it even more so. Now this piece sold, you guys. <laughs> and that brawl, you were commissioned by Joanna Gaines to do paintings for the silos. <laughs> That's fabulous. Yeah. Those yeah, are they, great ideas. Yeah. This I is, love their creativity. I love they're really good. Y'all are giving me some ideas of things that I should like we're writing, on my we're actually writing this stuff to do down. list. Let's let's try doing that sometime. All right, honey. I think you've got quite a few people on, so you better not keep them waiting. Is it more than two? Uh you're at 353 on Facebook and at 85 on the tubes. All right. All right. So I think we got everybody on here. All right. I'm gonna get a drink of water. I told you. Someone said a clothing line. Yeah, yeah. There's quite a bit of that. Okay, so I have to tell I have to tell a quick little story with this too. Um, so I like visuals. Okay, you all see these things. Okay, when I was very young, I started collecting magazines. This was well before Pinterest, okay? So I have, to this point, I still have, I don't know, a hundred magazines that no, are thousands. 2012, no big. Thousands of magazines. Okay. I mean, We've thousands. moved five times together and yeah. he has moved a lot of magazines. But the thing is, I have been saving them and these are all over the house. My mom can attest for that. Um, they're in my studio and they're in the living room. They're sleeping in the kitchen. They're in my, my office. And I found ways to go through magazines. I mean, look, you see why I never get rid of these things? Look, look, the most beautiful images on the front and they never go out of style. Think about it. El Decor, Vogue. Think about your magazines, you guys. So you may not have been a collector. My mom said I was a pack rat. But every, both of my grandmothers were serious about their ladies' home journal. You know what I'm talking about? Like, magazines have been iconic in the history of all things, right? Everything, all right? So I have collected these. And when we moved, we had to downsize once before, six years ago. But God loved Matthew. He would lug those boxes from house to house. And he would say, you tear out the pages of the ones that you love. And then you file them away with, you know, classified, because this was before Pinterest, you put them in dining room, living room, bedroom, you put them all that, and then you still save the magazine. Why don't you just throw the magazine away after you pull out your favorite pages, but then I'll not have the magazine. And I told him one of these days, I'm going to be in a magazine. I don't know what I'm going to do, because this was well before I was in my, had started a business. All right. I don't know, maybe I'm gonna wear a pretty dress. Maybe I'll model in them, maybe I'll do something. But because my grandmothers spent so much time saving theirs, and especially my grandma Danita, she stacked up her magazines. And when I would go and stay with her, there was nothing for me to do. So I read those magazines cover to cover. Ladies Home Journal, you were like this. So in my mind, and so many of you, um, I know that you have a bajillion magazines as well. 
as a little girl, I thought one of these days I'm going to be in a magazine. I, again, I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know how I'm going to get there, but wouldn't it just be amazing if someone contacted me and said, you're going to be in a magazine. Would you like to, can we feature you? Can you? And guys, nobody's contacted me wanting to feature me in a magazine. Is that what y'all thought I was going to say? Nobody. Well, it happens. Not yet. I'm still holding out. There's a reason that I'm telling you guys this story. There's a reason why I'm telling you this story. Don't let your goals die. Don't let your dreams die. If you can work and find people that believe in you and believe in your dreams and see something in you that you don't see in yourself, it's so very possible to not only be featured, just publish your own. Publish your own magazine if you're not going to be, right? Let's just do, let's go bigger. Let's go bigger. Let's feature you guys in the Turquoise Iris Journal. The website, it's being built. The Facebook page, it's here right now. This is my way of giving you guys your voice after my first feature, by the way. I'm going first. This is my way of saying, we are here. We are moms and dads. We are retired. We are young. We've been painting furniture. We've been building our life. We've been building our careers. And we're here to stay. And we want the attention. We want the notoriety of being in a publication. So we're going to do it. What are we going to do? We're going to do a magazine. Woo! <laughs> We're going to do a magazine. It's already in the works, guys. The website's being built. All of it. This is for this group of people. This is for us, okay? I'm going to read you our mission statement so you get exactly what I'm trying to say. Sorry that I'm so sick and breathy. I want to introduce to you the Turquoise Iris Journal. It's a paint journal. The things you're going to see in it are paint. You're going to see lots of creating. You're going to see home and you're going to see lifestyle. All right. All of those things under this umbrella and you get to submit your work. You get to submit it. We will feature you. We will do tutorials. We Okay. Listen, um, it's a quarterly art and lifestyle magazine centered around exploring color in unexpected ways throughout our work, our lives and our mindset. It's mission is to amplify creative voices, it's you. Empower all artists, that's you. To recognize the value that they bring to this world. Each issue will include a featured cover artist, painting, craft tutorials, articles about mindset and creativity. There'll be lots of videos, there'll be lots of downloadables, and much, much more than just that. Those of you that know you're in my creative connection, I bring way more than just a painting group to that creative connection. We're bringing a, a lot there. Um, more importantly, the Irish Journal is what we're gonna call it, nickname it, the Irish Journal. It's a call to action from my heart to yours, a call to that creative part of you and a reminder that you and your gifts matter. So, submissions. Those will start next month. The website's being built. The Facebook page is up right this moment. Um, this is, again, you know, when I started my Creative Connection, I said, I'm going to find a way to help others with stuff I didn't have. So we're going to do these features because it's still a dream of mine to be in a magazine. And yeah, I'm going to be the first one. But I had someone say to me a few months ago, a very special little girl, and I say little girl, named Cammie. And she said, you really should do a magazine. And guys, I poo-pooed her idea like, you're crazy. You're crazy. And I, and I said, why though? Like, why would you even say that to me? Because you know, I'm sensitive. And she didn't know that was a dream of mine just to be in one. And I still have never, I mean, I no, have been featured. Whoopie do. What does it mean? What does it even amount to? That's what I was telling myself. 
And then she gave me her reasons. And I still poo pooed that idea, but it stuck with me, you guys. Someone dropped a seed, you know? And then I woke up one morning and I started doing some research. And I looked at Matt and said, We're doing a magazine. He was like, What, what were you like? So I was like, All right. All right. He's totally on board with this. He's over the moon. He's excited. But guys, that's my point. Don't let someone tell you your dreams can't come true. Find the people that believe in you. Find the people that are encouraging you. Find the ones that are lifting you up and seeing things in you that you don't see. And that will work just as hard to make your dreams come true. You deserve that. You deserve that. So I am so over the moon to get this thing started. I'm scared. But I also know that I'm not doing it alone. And I have a really, really good team that's working together. Miss Michelle, who's here to help you guys all the time. She's going to be our accounts manager, subscription manager. Um, and Cammie's going to be the editor. And we're going to publish this, babe, this fall. All right? You guessed it. Once, once you brought those magazines out, boy, it started flowing then. Well, you got, you got some smart folks in here. I'm a visual person. I'm a visual. So I thought if you knew the backstory, it would help you understand how powerful this is for me and how 110% I'm in. I have just, this was before Pinterest, you guys, and magazines to me, I mean, think about it, Vogue. Like, think about the iconic magazines, how they have helped so many people. And I'm saying women more so, uh, but National Geographic, like, no, it's not going to be necessary. It's not going to be in print. Everything's kind of gone more towards digital magazines. Um, but guys, this is we're going to load you up with tutorials. We're going to load you up with features and uh, downloadables and all kinds of things. It's just going to be so much fun for our industry to take part in. And we're going to bring attention to us. And we're going to um, shout it from the rooftops. Rooftops. How much fun this is going to be. Um, anybody have any questions? Uh Online paper, what are we doing here? We are digital, we are online. This sucker is going to drop into your inbox. The reason we're doing it that way, um, A is for cost, I need to make sure this goes over well. Um, but B, with the digital, you get links. I can send you straight to, hey, guess what? Do you like that? I can send you straight to it. I can connect uh, videos. Every featured uh, person will be giving a uh, tutorial, and so there's going to be so much more involved than just pretty pictures. Um, we will pick a new cover artist for each issue. We're gonna start with the fall. Uh, there will be a spread. Some of you could even run ads if you wanted to. It's just, it's a way um, I, that I thought to myself, what are we missing? What do we not have in our industry right now? You guys, what do we not have? And it just made sense for, for me to bring them the, the magazine, the paint magazine. It's about creating, it's a lifestyle. Um, the photographer comes in a couple of weeks. Like it's, it's exciting. It's been going on and I've been dying to tell you, um, it's the Turquoise Cyrus journal, such as Magnolia has a journal. It's not called the magazine. Um, we will do so many different things. There will be people that show up each, um, the same person will be writing um, a column on mindset, a column on ADHD, a column on um, our power word. There will be one focus word for each uh, issue. And um, like, I'm just telling you guys, there's so many little things that have been going on. Um, thank you for the congratulations. Um, we're gonna shorten it to Irish, Irish Journal um, when we're talking about it in a real casual way. <sighs> I thought my heart would settle down by now, babe. <laughs> Uh, it's not settling down yet. It's not so. Well, it's okay. I'm let, still here, just let, like. Let me let me uh, let me uh, give you a break here. Okay. Um, Kristen Hicks, can we submit writings? Yes, you can submit. We will have we have a submissions form all ready to go. The website's already being built, guys. This is actually I'm having a totally new website built for this magazine. When will that website be available? So. Um, the website will be available well before the magazine launches, but you guys will actually be able to start submitting mid-August. So in just a few weeks, you'll be able to start submitting. So you can be featured 
in the journal. Okay, honey, you want to do some with me? Get it out, honey. Go ahead and get it out. Shake it out. Woo! I'm feeling better now. Okay, so Woo. so you told them time. They can start submitting. I'm probably forgetting a bunch of details. I know. I know. We're trying to work through it. Cammy, are you on here, sister? Cammy, are you on here? Um, what have, have you nailed down a cost for this subscription? Right? Absolutely. We're gonna do a early bird special. You can buy the whole year up front. Um, and then you, or you can buy the year or, or one issue at a time. Um, we are keeping this very low for having that many tutorials and downloadables in it. So each issue will be $14.97. Um, if you do the early bird in August, you can actually buy all the whole year, uh, all four issues for $49.97. So it's totally, totally. Thank you for all the likes and the hearts and the shares. You guys are blowing it up tonight. Jennifer Beth, will we be able to advertise via the journal? Yes, you may. And yes, all that's may. going to be set up through the website. As all of it is going to be, yep, yep. We're working on all of that right now. Um, in the next couple of days, I will actually have a link for you to sign up for your email. Um, you will be notified when anything's going on. But mid-August, probably about April, uh, August 15th, you can actually start with the submissions and you can um, submit to be featured. Thank you so and much, Jasmine. Was that Jasmine for mm -hmm. the $20? Mm -hmm. Jasmine, thank you so much. Judy, it is a deal, but you know what? We're coming in because I want it to be available to everybody. So for $49.97, you guys are going to get the whole year, um, the first four issues. And then we've got other plans coming after that, but I'm and not going to talk about it. And it's not just for the group. It's for anybody and everybody who wants it. Is that correct? It's for everybody. We're going to feature artists of all kinds. We'll have different uh, people who use different paint, different mediums, um, home. I want to see, there's going to be flea market, uh, a, a segment where there's someone um, that goes flea market searching and there's going to be a children's project in every single issue. Like I said, um, I have people lined up that are coming back in every issue already who will be writing something that's powerful you guys this is to empower us this is all that i've been wanting to do is to continue to empower you and make uh, make things available to you um and just <sighs> so so in a couple of weeks when the website launches it'll have all the information as far as how much um stuff like that well the right? whole yeah 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 all of that information will be available in the, about four weeks four maybe weeks. sooner but i'm not trying to put too much pressure on the web designer but yes we will do a round top antiques week there will be um all of those type things we will have all of that we will send somebody and they will do videos and show all their finds we will do all of that M must you have must you have your own business to submit your work no you do not have to have your own business. Now we will have criteria. We will, we will have questions already that we've already have lined up for submissions, uh, but it is open to anyone and everyone. We will just of course narrow it down for what our focus issue is at this moment, you know, our focus word, and then um, we will build around that. Okay. Yep. Will you email us when it's ready? Yes, we will be in the next few days, uh, probably by next week, I will have a link that I'll send out in an email and you will make sure you're on the email list to be notified when the magazine and when the submission forms are ready. We will be collecting those, gathering those. There are three of us that will be going through all the submissions. Um, I'm so excited, you guys. I, I um, you know, when I first, I always tell the story that, um, guys, we're going to paint the stuff. You know what I mean? So we, I might as well start teaching. We might as well start raising the bar. You know, there are so many people who are rescuing pieces of furniture or exploring their creativity on canvas, et cetera, et cetera. And they're turning these things into beautiful works of art and they're finding a part of themselves that they didn't even know existed. But they're making a little extra money that's bettering their life and their family and they're going and standing on their, like, on their own and they're, you know, my point in saying all this, we're going to paint the stuff no matter what, right? And so one thing that has always got under my skin is when someone picks on someone for painting furniture. I get there are authentic antiques, you guys, but that gets under my skin when you guys get picked on or when I get picked on. We are rescuing furniture. You know what I mean? And we are turning it in and giving it new life. And I want 
that respect. I want us to have that respect. We are good. We are recycling. We are repurposing. We are doing all the beautiful things that we can to save discarded, unwanted, unloved furniture. So I will have artists of all kinds. All right. I will have, um, home decor. We will do lifestyle. I will have my favorite things and I'll click and I'll link and maybe you do earrings and I, I feature you or maybe maybe you do different things. Um, top 10 favorite things. But the reason we're doing digital is because it's clickable and then you can download it and you guys have your phone or your iPad in front of you all the time. And so it just makes so much more sense because then you can take those things from the website, which is right now, guys, it's not up yet, but it's the turquoise iris journal.com. All right. You'll go have its very own website. Um, and then you'll be able to download those items as long as you are a subscriber. You know what you be end up going, um, all I see is hell. Yeah. <laughs> that makes me laugh. Brassy mobs. Woo! Over on Instagram. Um, okay. Is there, are there any more questions? Betty said that is a great way to promote people. I think so too, Ben. And I, that was kind of a lot of what was behind it, figuring out a good way to incorporate lots of people who mm -hmm. want to participate, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. And so it's 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 going to be a lot of fun. Well, a lot of fun. what all of you, all the things that you guys have fallen in love in, with with printable magazines and the things that I fell in love with and the daydreams that used to happen um, when I would just look at photos and think one of these days I'm going to have a house that looks like that. Or one of these days, I'm going to be able to buy a dress that looks like that. And I'm just going to put all of that into play and try to make this the most beautiful magazine you've seen. All right. The most beautiful magazine, this Iris Journal. And I'll tell you what, it couldn't be called Iris Magazine because there's already one. Or it would have been Iris Magazine. But I really like the turquoise Iris, the journal, and then, you know, we can call it a paint journal. Um, it's for us creatives, you guys. And I, my face hurts now and I have a headache. <laughs> I am hot. Are you going to paint a little bit? They probably want to see you paint. I don't know. Bit. I don't think I feel like it. Uh, I don't really think they care. All I was going to do was just continue to add um, the copper pennies to all of this trim, which has this piece sold the other day. I got the message the other day. And so it's, uh, a returning customer fell in love with it. And so it will be heading to Virginia as soon as I get it finished. Um, you're already following. The Facebook page is up and running, you guys. I published it just a couple minutes before we went live because I was afraid someone would see it. Um, however, more things are coming every single day. There will be a, a, a page that I'll be giving you the option to click and then add your email so you will be notified of everything up and coming. Go ahead and subscribe, like the Facebook page. Um, we will be posting things like that. Tammy Reed, thank you so much. I am just having the best time, but I'm going to tell you right now, if one person hadn't dropped that seed in my mind and actually believed that I could do this, I wouldn't be doing it. Surround yourself with people that are encouraging and loving and see something in you that you may not see in yourself. If Find those people, guys. They're there. They're there. Find them. And then start believing in yourself. Believe that you can. Um, Matthew's been on board from day one. He never once said, this is crazy. What are you doing? I don't think so. Like Matthew's been on board and I, I had the option of doing things a certain way with the website and stuff. And he from day one was go big go big, like go girl. And so thank you, Matthew. <laughs> Don't laugh at me, but thank you, Matthew. You're welcome. Thank you, Q. Will you still do my favorite paint show? Of course. Of course, I'm going to still do my favorite how to paint show. I will be here um, for sure. We have baseball the next three days, but I will for sure be here on Sunday. We have the All-State Baseball game downtown for my oldest on Saturday. So we have a couple of really big things coming up in the next few days. But we'll be back on Sunday. I don't think I'm going to paint tonight. I appreciate you all with all of my heart. Thank you for going and liking and following the Facebook page. More information is coming at you. 
a lot of information is going to be coming at you. Does anybody have any more questions? Alice just joined. Oh, Alice, you've got to go back and watch the replay, sister. Um, let's see the pretty dress. Oh, you will. You will. Do you mean this one? Because this is just a top. But um, there will be pretty dresses. <laughs> I have butterflies in my stomach. I'm so happy for you. Thank you so much for that. And if it for wonderful people like yourselves, we, we, we might not be where we're at. So we do thank you very, very much. Absolutely. If I didn't have the encouragement, man, Facebook page name, please. It's the Turquoise Cyrus Journal. Same, it's the name of the magazine. It's the Turquoise Cyrus Journal. And um, thank you. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. Thank you. We're going to do this. Um, we're going to make this something. We're going to highlight artists. We're going to highlight these talented moms and dads and aunts and uncles, um, grandparents. We are, you know, we are going to release it this fall. And um, it's going to be good. It's going to be good. I, there's some more details that I, I know for sure, but I'm not going to reveal them just yet. Um, I'm going to say that. Sorry, because I can. Because I can. All right, you guys, I'm going to sign off. I'm sweating. I'm going to go. Um, I think I'm going to go sit outside. Can we do that, babe? Let's go jump in the pool. Go jump in the pool. All right, I'm going to sign off with Instagram. Thanks for hanging out. You guys. See ya. I love you.